I am Dr. Aarti Venkatraman, Devi Eye Hospital. I am a cataract and refractive surgeon. Today I am going to talk to you about what cataract is, what are the symptoms, what causes cataract and cataract surgery. Now coming to what is cataract. Cataract is clouding of the natural lens. As you can see here, this is the normal human eye. This is called the cornea which is the transparent structure over the eye followed by the iris and a small opening in the center called the pupil behind which you will get the natural lens. This natural lens is transparent when we are young. As we age the protein structure in the natural lens changes and there is water accumulation causing it to become opaque. So the natural lens from clear becomes opaque which is called cataract. Now when we try to see through a clouded lens the vision does not reach the retina which is the nerve of the eye and thereby vision becomes blurred. Treatment of cataract involves removing of the natural lens and replacing them with an artificial lens of the patient's eye power. Thereby with minimal requirement for glasses patient is able to see clearly. So what causes cataract? Cataract as I told you earlier is a normal aging process. About half the population develop a bit of cataract by 60 years and almost entire population by the age of 70 develop a bit of cataract. Apart from aging, diabetes is another major cause of cataract and other medications like steroids cause cataract as well in younger age. Apart from that eye injury can cause cataract and UV light damage can also cause cataract. Now what are the symptoms of cataract? When do you need to see a doctor for cataract? First thing obviously becomes blurring of vision wherein you go for frequent change in your glasses or contact lenses to make your eye vision clearer. Second thing is glare especially at night time when you see street lights or headlamps cause a lot of glare for you. The, uh, in spite of your vision being clear, nighttime glare is a symptom of cat early cataract. Other than that, you will have uh, dulling of colors, blue hues especially, because blue light gets more filtered by a cataract lens than a normal lens. Apart from that, night vision loss may also be there in cataract. So what are the common questions asked before cataract surgery? How is cataract detected? As I already told you, there is the eye which has a small opening in the center called pupil. What we do, we put drops to dilate the pupil, make the pupil a little larger so that we see the cataract which is there inside the eye. We get to know the amount of cataract and how it is affecting your vision in the same way. And this we use a machine called slit lamp to do the same. How fast does cataract develop? Each cataract depends on uh, uh, the person. If a person is diabetic which is uncontrolled or have a family history of uh, cataract which develops at earlier age, that person's cataract will develop a little faster than another person which may take 2-3 to three years to develop as well. When should a person have cataract surgery? Cataract surgery is advised for people when it affects your daily activity. Your vision blurring is causing you issues with your normal daily activity. That is when a cataract surgery is advised. Apart from that, cataract surgery may also be advised in case the patient's eye is little smaller and the cataract is a little larger, causing the, the angle of the eye to become narrow and thereby the pressure to increase. Once we remove the cataract, the eye pressure increase will settle down by itself. How long does the operation take? Cataract surgery typically takes about 10 to 15 minutes. It is a very uh, short procedure wherein the patient is normally awake. General anesthesia will not be required. You may require a small injection around the eye to numb the eye uh, during the process. Sometimes we do it with only drops which is called topical anesthesia. In any of the anesthesia, you will not have any pain during the surgery. Is cataract surgery permanent? Yes, once you remove the natural lens from the eye, you will be putting an artificial lens inside the eye. This artificial lens will not age 
and thereby the cataract surgery as such is permanent we normally do not touch the artificial lens at all will we need glasses after cataract surgery the eye and artificial lens that we put inside the eye the power will be calculated according to the patient's eye and it will be put in so glasses as such will not be required for normal life or at least 80 to 85% of the time it will not be required for distant vision for reading a person will require glasses there are specialized lenses that you can put into the eye called multifocal lens wherein both distance reading and intermediate visions may also be covered so without glasses about 80 to 85% of the time you will be able to do all your daily activities what if i have other eye diseases cataract may be associated with other diabetic problems in your nerve or a glaucoma wherein the eye pressure is high it can be treated simultaneously along with the cataract or sometimes we'll have to remove the cataract and then see the nerve clearly to treat the same okay does it hurt as i already told you normally the surgery we do it with under eye drops it's called topical anesthesia or we may give a small injection around the eye not inside the eye to numb the eye okay so you, uh, cataract procedure typically does not hurt can i have both eyes at the same time uh, we do not do both eyes at the same time we wait for a gap of about 3 to 5 days to see the recovery of the operated eye and it no, uh, typically takes about 1 to 2 days for the patient to recover their vision and once that eye has recovered we go ahead with the other eye so patient can take care of themselves and use uh, the post operative drops by themselves so if you do have any blurring of vision or any of the above mentioned symptoms of cataract please do come down to devi eye hospital where we have the latest technology including the centurial phaco emulsification machine and the zeiss microscope and we also have all the specialized lenses which are tailored to the different visual outcomes as per your expectations they include multifocal trifocal and toric lenses you can come down and reach us for more information for the same thank you